Hi everyone, how do you perform data quality checks in Informatica cloud mappings? Let us understand this question with a simple example. We have a table in the database as shown here. Note that in this table, employee ID, last name and high date are not null fields. That is, a record cannot be inserted into this table if any of these field values are null. Also note that the primary key is defined on the field employee ID. Hence, no record with a duplicate employee ID field value cannot be inserted into this table. So if we have to build an ETL pipeline to load data into this table, we need to perform three null validations and one deduplicate validation to identify the valid records before loading the data into the employee table. This is just one example. In a database, there could be numerous tables with multiple not null fields and with various constraints. There would be also tables with composite primary keys requiring a unique combination of different field values within that table. Manually implementing all these data quality check validations specific to each of these tables in ETL pipelines is a tedious task. Implementing data quality checks to identify a valid record is only step one. The next important step is understanding why a record fails the validations. Capturing details about why a record is considered invalid is crucial for clear understanding of data quality. What if you could automate this data quality check validations and error handling in Informatica cloud mapping? Yes, it is possible to automate all these data quality check validations and build a framework to capture the rejected records with a definitive error message. And that is exactly what we would be discussing in this course, automating data quality check validations and error handling in Informatica cloud mappings. What is covered as part of this course? The course starts with ultimate basics, such as how null validations should be performed in Informatica cloud mappings, how deduplicate validations should be performed in Informatica cloud mappings, how to capture the records that fail the validations defined. Finally, we cover the main part of the course where we automate the whole process of data quality check validations using a generic maplet component. This component can be used across mappings for data quality check validations where you need not code or define any rules for validations. All you need to do is map your source fields to the appropriate input fields of the generic component. The component performs all the defined validations coded within it and gives the result indicating if the record is valid or not and the error message indicating the reason for the rejection. The output from the automation component provides a reject flag indicating the record's validity and an error message explaining the reason for the rejection. The image here shows that we are performing null validations on five input source fields and a deduplicate validation on composite primary key of the table which is a combination of three fields using the automated generic component. Why you should invest in this course? You can elevate your proficiency in Informatica Cloud Data Integration. You can acquire hands-on experience in building automation components. You can master error handling procedures for records not meeting data quality standards. Performing data quality checks on the data you are reading is very basic yet very important and integral part of any project. And what if you could automate it and integrate it into your every raw or staging ETL pipelines? This could be a game changer, right? So are you ready to automate data quality check validations and master error handling in Informatica Cloud? The link to the course is provided in the description. Please visit the link for more details. Thank you.